Thanks, Doppler. From our New Mexico mobile newsroom, a Las Cruces Elementary School is dealing with mold, forcing some teachers and students to move to a different classroom. Potentially dangerous situation. ABC 7's Jason McNabb spoke with the superintendent of Las Cruces Public Schools, and he has this story. Behind me is Conley Elementary near Missouri and Locust, and Superintendent Ignacio Ruiz confirmed that mold spores have been found in one classroom. Now the district is considering testing the whole school for more. LCPS says he ordered mold tests after a couple teachers began complaining of illness. Superintendent Ruiz says the amount of mold in the classroom is in an acceptable range. He says it is within safe levels. However, a decision was made to move kids and a teacher out of the classroom out of precaution after higher amounts were found in a nearby closet. Ruiz says a full report from the mold test will be available on Thursday and will tell them what kind of mold is in the school. The district will also make a decision based on the results on whether or not the whole school needs to be tested. Ruiz says in the meantime, they are taking every precaution they can, including installing an air filtration system. We've, we've listened to our teachers. I have met with the staff over there working closely with the principal, with the teachers union, just to make sure that, again, our first priority is the safety of our children, the safety of our teachers. People I spoke to who have family within the school tell me they're frustrated with the way LCPS has handled the situation so far. I'll show you why the district says they don't want to stir up any unnecessary panic coming up on ABC 7 at 6. For now, reporting in Las Cruces with our New Mexico Mobile Newsroom, I'm Jason McNabb, ABC 7.